Hi guys, it's John Paul Canzero from TheEliteTrainer.com. A hot topic of discussion involves abdominal training. A lot of clients complain that they cannot feel their abdominals the next day, that they don't feel any soreness. Well, I've got a version for you, a variation of the abdominal crunch that I guarantee they'll feel. I wrote about this about 10 years ago and I still get emails on the subject daily. Okay? The version is what I've termed the Sicilian crunch. And the way it works is you get yourself in position over a Swiss ball, as you normally would during a, a Swiss ball crunch. But the difference this time is that you're going to be loaded. You're going to be loaded on the way up, but you're going to accentuate the loading on the way down. So you're going to have a dumbbell resting on your chest as you crunch upward, and then you're going to extend your arms and keeping your arms in line with your torso and staying nice and tight, you're going to have the arms extended on the way down. Okay, so I'll show you how it looks. Make sure you have your feet anchored under something that's going to support your weight or else you're going to go flying. Okay? Get into your initial position, rounded over the ball with the dumbbell resting high on your chest. Okay? Tongue against the roof of your mouth. And now from this point here, you're going to roll up one vertebrae at a time. Extend your arms up in line with your torso. Stay nice and tight and control. Slow, 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 slow down. Rounding over the ball at the bottom. Back of your chest. Up, extend, down, and continue. I recommend you start with a light weight. Five to ten pounds initially will be enough. And four to six reps is all you need. Just make sure you go slow on the way down. And your clients will feel that the next day.